Was in his opinion, he's the only one. He's always the only one. It's not very nice, this story. Beethoven devotes more energy than one might reasonably expect to the attempt to uh, uh, gain custody of Karl. I suspect that what is going on during this time is that Beethoven is seeking to repeat the pattern that played out in his own family as a child. Can we just uh, video this to an end? Almost a home video lesson. I won't his play. father <laughs> placed uh, a great deal of expectation okay, on <laughs> Ludwig to be essentially a second Mozart, and uh, Beethoven is perhaps hoping that Karl can do the same thing. Carl as your own child. He'd no gossip, no pettiness, no comparison with this sacred gold. That's with the seat, that's with the seat, that's with this, um, Apollitore. Yes. Is that right? Do 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 do. Do do do. Do do do. Do do do. Do of the guardianship is the Landrecht. And the Landrecht is a court for noblemen only. Okay. And at that point, the court asks, the people are the noblemen. And Ludwig says, yes, of course, because my name is Fabi. I've got to go back here now, Steve. It's just here, local. Nobility. I'm not going local, but... Right. Oh, it's here. Okay. The family is just here. personality that three, he wanted four, himself five, to be three, uh, and he three, fabricated uh, quite a lot of uh, yes, both <coughs> around, around this story. He had a tendency of to be bigger, a uh, great, uh, uh, nobler, narcissistically oh. driven. Bracket, um, yeah. uh, in all what he did. Where? Where did I get to, Stephen? Yeah. Oh, did I get to there? He, to fall there. Yeah. That's it. Yeah, so you've got that one with the G sharp. And now we can have Steve. Oh, it's about guessing. Ah, oh, it's about guessing. Now, next. Higher court decides. No, um. Right hand plays the beat. Well, two of these? Oh, right. 
Yeah. 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 Other hand. Now, if you look at the music there, Tony, where are you? Yeah, that, no, the last bar. You just up here. At the end of the bar. Yeah, you see you there, you've got your B. Got my B. And then you've got the chord. Oh, so, uh, the chord and then the B again. Chord says chord again. So that's a, a C chord again. Yeah, C. That's you right. play that twice, of course. So when yeah. I've done this, because I, I remember, I can remember this type of this thing because I've done it before in uh, the concerto and the uh, what do we call it concerto? Greek's piano concerto. And that's the program. Just some sort of thing. It's um, where was I then, Stephen? I was, I was here. Yeah, C, F sharp, A. That's correct. So I'll play that His twice. Slows yeah. Down. He goes into a period of deep reflection. So the B in the right hand. So, left hand first. And in the year uh, see, you just there. Nothing at all. I just did. Yeah. Until oh, it's the a C sharp. Go for C sharp. Okay. <laughs> Go from one of the first from this one, pieces that he writes actually says, after this long from this one, period it's is this go. beautiful song resignation. Oh, that D. Very you see it, so we have to come to back up here. Um, yes, with that D sharp. D sharp. And then if I remember that, bang. Octaves, but it's a soliloquy. G sharp and B. Speaking to the candle. G sharp. Yeah. Candle, you have to snuff out your light. Before. Well, because you had it at the beginning of the line. And we got that diminuendo. diminuendo. Yeah, that diminuendo. that's right. Going from medium loud down to soft. Poem. Okay, to your statement. But what they told him does with it is incredible because he messes around with the repetitions of the text and the final statement, let out your light. Beethoven is saying here, you have to let loose of what's been holding you back, but this is okay. Let me live, even by means of artificial aids. If only such are to be found. If possible, develop the ear instruments, then travel. Oh, is he? So. This you owe to yourself, to men, and to him, the Almighty. For the last 10 years of his life, starting in 1818, we have the so-called conversation books, which means that visitors that come to see him write down whatever they want to talk with him about. Because his hearing loss was so hard by the time that he just couldn't understand anymore what they would say. So they had to write down all the things they want, they want to tell him. And so the interesting thing about this is that we see how many different people come to see him and they talk with him That's about nice. all sorts of things, about wow. politics, <coughs> what's advertised in town, about music also. Yes. They drag terribly. In the aria, I'm following the singer. The overture to Coriolan confused the violoncello. Who sings now? I still remember the problem you had with the timpanist at the rehearsal of Egmont. I think that when constructing a sound machine, one must consult not merely a musician, but a well-grounded physicist, therefore an acoustician. Unfortunately, we don't have his, his answers because he speaks with them. Mm. 
but still we get a very strong sense of a man who still in his last years mm -hmm. of living is very mm -hmm. much tied to he can't what's hear on them, in society. But shouts back at them. Oh, I see, yes. This is one of the restaurants Beethoven frequents regularly, either alone or with friends. We know mm -hmm. of that because he writes about it in his conversation so books. In his later years, he's he 47. Understand them, so he is always down, a writer. He's a writer of his said. own ideas in oh, little see. books. He would then go, yes, I in agree. Coffee house in oh. And then they would uh, write meals, back their answers. 60 gulden celery, 25 gulden wine, 42 gilde 